actually I'll be co-hosting the record today with the Olave C. Oh wait, before you go, I have just one quick question as my brother in Christ. Yes, yeah, my brother in Christ now, you know now. <laughs> okay, what is the difference between marriage and settle down? Thank you, President. <laughs> Thank you so much uh, for that question. To me, getting married means uh, fall between the age of 18 to 28. That is, you're getting married, you're young, you're energetic, and you want to uh, get married. You're stable. Certainly, then, is from the age of 35 to 50. Your, your full community, your village people, your parents will come. You understand? Everybody will be on your neck, like, what is happening? Let's contribute. Everybody will contribute 1,000 and force you to get married. So we are we still on the red carpet now. I have the father and the mom, the bride, right? I'm so excited. Hello, sir. Thank you. How do you feel today? Your your little girl is getting married. I feel great. I'm happy. I have a message for my daughter. I just want to give her advice to be a peaceful woman, to be obedient, and to be submissive. <laughs> now, then, how much did this hurt your pocket? The entire everything, because she told us about everything she's, she's had on. Now, how much did this, this hurt your pocket? Anyway, the truth is that no matter how much it costs, Atinoke what more than that. That's just the simple truth. Okay, we are still at the cool wedding of uh, Atinoke. Uh, hello, sir. Hello. Okay, sir. Um, tell me something about the couple. What you know about the couple today? I know the father for the for the wife. That's a Mr. We work with Dr. Larry Waju. We work together at the National Bureau of Services in Abuja. And they came from there to come and do the wedding today. But I'm happy for today. We pray that it's going to be the best of the best day for them. Okay, it's still about asking look at Anne Shagun. Hi, hi. What's your name, ma'am? Yeah, I'm Choma Kimakulam. Okay, Choma. All right. So, are you coming with the groom or the bride? The bride. You have the friendship gang. Um, Let us know. Uh, not really. Uh -huh. the, the father is my boss in the office. Oh, really? That's mm -hmm. cool. Okay, so what do you have to say about Atinuke? Um, she's a wonderful lady. Ah, uh, if I start saying something about her, I cannot do what I'm doing in this life. <laughs> so, but I'm happy that she's marrying today. I'm so much happy. Yeah. That's great. Okay, so what, what advice do you have for Atinuke and her boo? Yeah, I have to advise her because marriage is not all about this we are seeing. You understand? This is wedding, but marriage itself is when everybody have gone home. So you have to endure. All of us are married, but it means you have to make sure that you keep your home as a woman. But always remember that you are not marrying each other, you are marrying into the family. So in your behavior, in the way you treat each other, 
just think of the, of the big family. And then you learn to tolerate and forgive each other. It's going to happen. There's no way about it. Look at Hi. Your dad, your mom, your friends, and everyone keeps saying, Oh, you're such a nice person, you're so easy going, you're so cool. They wouldn't tell you the bad part of me anyway. <laughs> I don't want to advertise him for anyone, so he's a crazy guy, nobody comes near him. <laughs> you, you, can raise your hand like that? Keep, keep, off, keep, keep off. off. He's taken. All right, so, um, okay, can you tell us about the relationship? You know, and. The relationship is a long distance relationship, a very long distance relationship. But thank God. We come. So how did it pop the question? Uh, that's uh, the best part now. Tell, tell us that part. We want to know how it did it. It was on um, April Fool. Really? Yeah. So I thought it was fooling me. <laughs> so you just were like, what do you want for, for this April? I said, okay, baby, just give me a kiss. And the ring was in his mouth. That's the first? I remember when he had something that dramatic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was very happy. It was just the both of us. No paparazzi and all that. That's sweet. All private. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so how long did it take you to plan your big day today? Two months. <laughs> Three and a half. <laughs> and I almost woke up. I get to them. <laughs> go now, go now, go now. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, right about now, I'm going to leave you and my together. Let's do this. Three. Wonderful. Wonderful. Shegun is actually a great guy. He's my colleague in the office, and uh, yeah, we work together. And he's an awesome person, and I'm happy that he's getting married today, and to a very beautiful lady as well. I think it's so beautiful, so amazing. I love that there's a red carpet right now. I think that's so regal. Um, I'm so excited. This is my first Nigerian traditional wedding. Uh huh. So what, what advice would you give to the couple? Mm, they should keep loving each other the way they are, they are loving each other right now till forever, you know. That's cool. Okay, so what do you have for them? What do you have to... You want to sing for them? Do you believe in love of love? <laughs> I'm very happy for today. It's the day I've been actually looking up to you. Um, I just want to use this opportunity to tell my Atinoke that I love her so much. So, so much. She's so caring. Anything that we do, you people should do. Just imitate us, follow us. I want to show you how we do it. Shadu, are you a paramancer? Mm -hmm. Right, she's your sister, so tell me about her. My sister, of late, we've not really been close because of school and everything, but with the years we've spent together, I can say she's a wonderful sister. I'm proud of her. So, how do you feel when, when she brought Shagun and she's like, okay, little brother, this is my boo? It's normal to feel somehow like, ah, uh, my sister, she's going with a guy, but I actually got close to Shagun, so on the long run, I got comfortable with them. I think they will be good together. Oh, you know, they are great people in the industry, so you know we're here to give them a support. What advice do you have for the bride and groom? Yeah, uh, it's a new journey, you know, for them. So we've been in it, we're in it, you know. So uh, it's, all, it's a new school. So I wish them the best, you know. Beautiful people and so much love. Okay, so how long have you loved the bride or the groom? What are you here for exactly? Um, I'm here for the bride. 
I'm not for I don't know. Fifteen years I can so very excited. I was very, very excited and I'm still very excited and I'm very happy to be here right now. Okay, how about you? What do you have to say to the couple today? Mm, I wish them a happy married life, wonderful kids, more wealth, in health. Yes. My name is Mrs. Mrs. Motipola Ogoji. I'm a family friend to Mrs. Oni and I'm happy to be here today. I wish the couple happy married life and good health. I wish them all the best, best marriage life, long life and prosperity. I wish the couple abundant joy and God's blessings. Above all, I wish them the success of marriage. It's nice to be here today. It's the wedding of Sinuke. We are very happy to be here. I wish the couple's happy married life. And that is love. Show them. We officially Mr. and Mrs. Adepoju. My name is Bola Akonji. I'm Kemi. I'm Lyos. Come on, Kemi. Vivian. My name is Abola. And my name is Ruby. Keep watching. Keep watching. Keep watching. Keep watching. Hello, guys. We're the bridesmaids. And keep watching Red Carpet on TV. Red Carpet on TV. Red Carpet on TV. Red Carpet on TV. Keep watching Red Carpet on TV. Keep watching Red Carpet on TV. Keep watching Red Carpet on TV. Red carpet on TV. Woo -hoo.